when they get it, they literally can't believe they did it. Now you're gonna make me blush right on I camera. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> is there gonna be Jenny on the road? I'm Shalane, this is Dean, and we are Grassroots, Grassroots Living. Living. About to see the world in action, what we can be, life with no distraction. Hey friends, thank you so much for coming back for part two of our Jenny video. Thank you mostly for being patient. She um, recorded that all in one clip, but I was unable to get it out to you all in one clip. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, last week we actually put out a video with um, Jenny Doan of MSQC, Missouri Stark Quilt Company, and she was so showing us, giving us a little tour of her glamper at the Sisters on the Fly event. It was super cute, and the Sisters on the Fly had a lot of really cute glampers too, and watch for that. We've got a video coming out about that event, so that's a lot of fun. Um, anyway, I, we got a little tour of her little camper and then I was gonna ask her some questions and do a really short little interview. She had a lot of people waiting to talk to her so we had to go pretty quick. But these are the questions that I asked her. This is the little interview that I did with her and most of these questions, and there's not very many, but they came from you um, from the Facebook page, RV, the RV Quilters Facebook page. And so I asked her those questions and I did ask her one question off screen that I will share with you at the end. So stay till the end and I will tell you what I ask her and what her question or what her answer is. So let's get to the interview. Here we go. Now you're gonna make me blush right on I camera. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you're, the question's real quick. Okay, so um, when will the shops open, which we know they yep, just they recently opened. Yep. opened. First week of um, May. Do they need masks? Um, we, so they just recently came out with a whole, the CDC came out with a whole thing is if you're vaccinated, you don't want to wear masks. Um, we decided that um, we're kind of leaving it up to people. There's a, there's a uh, picture on the door that says wear a mask, you know, and right. so if you're sick or you uh, haven't been vaccinated or anything like that, just yeah. still keep being careful. Sure. But we're kind of, you know, nobody's going to tackle you if you come through the door without a right. mask on. <laughs> right. Um, on that same note with COVID, is there going to be Jenny on the road? Probably not this year, no. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Ooh, something's going on outside. We better hustle. <laughs> Where can I find scheduled workshops? They wanted to know. So, um, our, actually our first, uh, well, we have a retreat every single week. Okay. And actually, here's what you do. You go to Missouri Star website, and on the side, you'll click down and you'll see events, and you click on events, and that's where all our events are. Perfect. And you can click into those. We're not doing a ton this year. We're, we're going to do our birthday bash in September. Yes. But we're not doing Academy and that sort of thing. But we do have a retreat every single week. And so, and then there's three uh, Dome Girl retreats this week. So Misty, Natalie, and I do a retreat so uh, for about 100 people. And I think those are actually already, already sold out. But you know what? Don't hesitate to get on a waiting list because, you know, yeah. you never know what's going to happen. And a lot of times you can get on. Yes. Um, and you can always come to Hamilton anyway. That's all. Oh, <laughs> it's, it, just, it just fills up your soul to be here. Hey, if you're enjoying this video, Please give it a great big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and click on all notifications. Now let's get back to Jenny. Um, one more. Have you ever taught kids to quilt? Eight to eleven year old girl and I a have. boy is what this sweet yes. lady has. So here's what we do. We teach the 4-H kids come here and the easiest thing to do is to give them some lined paper, like binder paper, and let them practice sewing on the lines. And when they feel like they can, no thread or anything like that, but when, when they feel like they can sew on the lines and stay on them, then give them a couple of squares and show them where their edge is and let them sew that together. So what we do is we give them a layer cake that's 42 squares. So they're going to sew a straight seam six times and their row is done and then they're going to sew those rows together seven times and that's done so literally in the day that they're here uh, it generally only takes a couple two three four hours for them to sew this quilt together and when they get it they literally can't believe they did it so you have you have things here you have events or classes here where you we do have some 4-H'ers come periodically ah, and okay. uh, we have a group of ladies who teach them so perfect 4-H is my love because that's where I learned to sew yeah um, let's see, still there, da, 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 da. would you ever think about full-time RVing? Oh yes, definitely, yeah. definitely. That's on my list. I don't, I don't think I'm going to full-time for uh, a while, but mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, I had my assistant book us into, at least once a month, book us into a campground and they told her I wanted them to be like two or three hours away at the most. And, um, and so every month now we're going to some place we don't know, we've never been. And it's so much fun because it's like a little surprise for us. 
you know. Yes. So uh, here, the next one that we're going to, I'm not sure exactly when it's happening, but we're going to go to Palm de Terre, which I just oh, learned I... is Potato of the Earth. Yes. Which I was like, that's not near as <laughs> as exciting as Palm de Terre. <laughs> Palm de Terre is beautiful. Is it beautiful? You're going to love Palm oh, de Terre. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm okay. so glad. Okay, you have a waiting little fan club out we there. We do. So I'm going to let you go, but thank you so much oh, for doing you're so this. Welcome. Thanks for coming and back in. Say hi bye to all your all oh, you guys. Quilting fans. Keep traveling and keep sewing. You see I have my little sewing machine yep. in here as well. So keep traveling and keep sewing. We'll see you later. All right, we would like to say a big thank you to Jenny for taking the time to do that for us. We all appreciate it so much. We adore her. And just so you guys out there that are RV quilters, any quilters really, but um, she's very aware of her community and of her supporters and she very much loves and appreciates you. And so I just wanted to pass that on. Um, also, I mentioned that I did ask a question of Jenny off screen. It was actually a few weeks ago that I asked her uh, and then I didn't talk to her about it this time, but I don't think that she would mind if I share it. So I'm going to do that. On every video that we have had with Jenny, you guys have um, said how much you love and adore her, but many of you were a little concerned just about her weight loss and you just wanted to make sure that she was healthy and um, not sick. Jenny is fine and she just has chosen to adopt a healthy lifestyle. We had that conversation and she was super just um, happy about the lifestyle choices that she had made and she's totally fine and she's totally healthy so you don't have to worry about her and I just wanted to mention that because a lot of people had mentioned it. Um, you guys had asked about it and I knew that I would get more comments today about it if we didn't mention it but Jenny is fine. She's beautiful. She's healthy. She is aware of you, and again, we'd like to thank you, Jenny, for taking the time to do this for us. Click on the screen if you haven't seen the other videos and check that out. And also, we're going to be traveling a ton um, this upcoming year, so travel with us. And uh, we'll be doing other quilt shops all over the country and just destination videos, too. We have a ton of epic adventures coming up, so stay tuned for that. We'll see you guys. Peace out.